Hello! Welcome to June the 1st, 2020. It's Mr. Kane's story time and Music Monday with Nancy Kaufman, who joined us earlier. How amazing was that on our Google Meet um, this morning? And she sang some songs for all of us to join in. I love when people who are creative share their stuff together. Isn't it amazing? Thank you, Nancy, as always. We'll be joining uh, with Nancy a little bit later on after I finish reading today. Uh, we're going to be talking about breathing and the importance of breathing. Her song is going to be focused on that. You all know how much slowing down and taking your time and focusing on healing yourself through breathing, through meditation, through placing your hand on your heart. You know how that impacts and helps to regulate your emotions, especially in those times where you're feeling overwhelmed or you're frustrated or you're angry or you're sad or you're tired. It allows you a chance to sort of pull it all together as long as it takes to then be able to effectively communicate using your words what it is that's really going on with an adult who cares so that they can hopefully help ease you out of it guide you out of it so that you can get yourself reconnected uh, with the environment that you're in and proceed with your day. Because you know what? We all have moments and days where we feel frustrated and angry and a whole range of emotions. We're not always just happy. That only really happens to robots. And do robots really feel? Hmm, that might be a good book idea. Anyway, today, let's get started. We're all together again, we're here, we're here. We're all together again, we're here, we're here. And who knows when we'll be all together again. Well, every day at 11 a.m., Circle Not Circle on Google Meet, each day at 2.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, Mr. Kane's Story Time. So we'll see each other again tomorrow. We're all together again, we're here, we're here. Like I said, it is June the 1st, brand new month of June. It, we're in the final weeks of the school year for 2019 to 2020, and what a year it's been, my friends. Um, it's also the kickoff to Pride Month, uh, which is a festival very dear to my heart and a celebration of Pride. I will be reading um, stories that are related to pride and what pride means, um, about celebrating diversity in families, as it should be all the time, diversity in our communities, right? Right? Today is Monday and June. Today is Monday and June. Monday is here, so is June. Everybody cheer, also for June. Today is Monday, also June. All day and month long. Oh, did you like that? All right, today I'm sharing a book by Susan Verde, artwork by the author and artist Peter H. Reynolds called I Am Peace, a book of mindfulness. This goes beautifully with Nancy's song today about breathing. And again, took the cover off, and it reveals different art on the back and the front cover. There are times when I worry about what might happen next and what happened before. Me too. It happens. The thoughts in my head are like running water and I feel like a boat with no anchor. It can be very overwhelming. Make you feel panicky and make you feel anxiety. Like being carried away. Not being able to keep it under control. I give myself a moment I take a breath, and then I tell myself it's all right. I feel the ground breathe beneath my feet, and I steady myself. And start to notice the here and the now, but being present in the day that you're in, not getting ahead of yourself and thinking about tomorrow, or the week after, or the month after, but about being here and enjoying every single second and minute and hour and moment of the day. If you don't, you miss out on so much. My thoughts begin to settle. My mind begins to clear. I am peace. I can watch my worries gently pop and disappear. I let things go. 
I can say what I feel inside, out loud, I know myself. I can share kindness with others, I make a difference. We all do. What do you observe is happening? First, we see something, we see the seeds dropping, and look what's growing now. I can hug a tree and thank it for its beauty and its strength. I connect to nature. I don't know about you, but I am always, always happiest when I am in nature, surrounded by water and trees and the sounds of birds palm of the water lapping against the shore. It's my favorite, favorite thing. I can watch the clouds make shapes against the sky. I know wonder. I can taste and smell and touch and hear and see what is all around me. I use my senses. I can feel my breath fill my whole body. Tune in to me. Now, each morning when we do Circle Not Circle, we, we start off with the listening bowl to help regulate us and get us focused and together so that we're able to be there. We do daily check-ins to see how we're feeling, if we're feeling amazing, if we're feeling just okay, or if we're feeling kind of low. And we try to see what we can do to inspire each other to allow those feelings, hopefully, to get to a place of okay or even better, amazing or not, until you're ready, right? Now the water is still, I have found my anchor and everything is all right. I don't need to worry about before or after, I am in this moment, I am peace. Now I share my peace with others and hope that it is carried away to those who need it. And I dream we are peace. So, my friends, remember that within you is the ability to manage and regulate your emotions and your feelings, especially when they're not feeling so great. Um, take that time. That's what self-care is about. It's about taking the time and using strategies that work for you, like breathing. And speaking of breathing, let's hand it off to Nancy, as she's about to share her song about the power of breath and breathing. Take it away, Nancy. Hi, I'm Nancy, and I have a song that goes really well with the story that Mr. Kane just read. It's called Breathe In, Breathe Out. And it's a song that you can use to remind yourself to take deep breaths in and deep breaths out to help you relax when you need it the most. I hope you like it. Here it is. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
I hope you liked that song. It's time for me to send you back to Mr. Kane. Bye bye. Welcome back. How did that feel? Did you take some breaths? Did you notice a difference in the way that you were feeling? What did you think of the song? Send your messages to me and I'll share them with Nancy. She loved the video I sent her last week with all of you saying thank you for joining us each Monday. And I know that she really loved being with us on our Circle Not Circle this morning. So hopefully we'll be able to get her back in again. That would be wonderful. Would you like that? Thank you for joining me today for Mr. Kane's Story Time and Music Monday with Nancy Kaufman. Um, I hope you had a wonderful day of learning. I hope you have a wonderful night and a beautiful sleep. We'll see you tomorrow morning at 11 a.m. I'm Mr. Kane, sending you out a big, huge virtual bear hug. I hope you have an amazing week. Thank you for joining me as always every day. And we'll see you again tomorrow. Bye, friends.